Hi. So for those of you who don't know, in the month of December, I'm uploading daily as a last push to get more content out there and also to document what I'm going through, where I'm at in life, what I'm thinking about. So today I've been thinking about like, lately, we all know the terms extrovert and introvert. And like, I think a pretty decent definition is an extrovert is someone who gains energy by being with people and an introvert is someone who gains energy by being alone. And it's such a toss up for me, for who I am, because I feel like when I'm around the right people, I'm the most energized person I've ever, I will ever be, I ever am. And when I'm around the very not right people, I just want, I want to be an introvert. Um, I don't know if I fit neatly into one but I think it's more of a spectrum anyways. But essentially, I was thinking about it and it reminds me of the fact, like, I don't know, today, yesterday, I've been kind of in a mood where I don't really wanna hang out with a lot of people. I kind of just wanna be one-on-one -on -one with the people I really care about. Um, and I always, it's a nice framework that I've downloaded into the mental database to how to combat, how to combat this feeling, how to combat loneliness. Cause when you get to the point where you don't want to be around people, it's a very easy turn to isolation. And that's something I've struggled with. When I get fed up with people, I just am tempted to lock myself in my room and just work on what, like work on projects, work on my videos and stuff. And that's not good. It, it, it doesn't help my mental health at all. So a nice little framework to combat loneliness, to kind of combat this feeling of not wanting to be around people is, and this is gonna suck and it's not gonna help anyone, but it's something that's worked in the past is to kind of force yourself to look out for other people. Like go and be helpful. Um, I saw this video of this like psychologist, it was like three minutes or something. And he was talking about how to combat loneliness. I think that's the video title. It's super viral and maybe the YouTube algorithm started up and threw it at you a couple of years ago. But like how to combat loneliness is essentially force yourself to not be lonely. Go be around someone and don't be around someone to have a great conversation or anything. You don't have to go be around someone and force yourself to be helpful, force yourself to provide value for them. And in that effort of trying to be there for someone else, you lose the feeling that there's no one there for you. You know what I mean? Um, which is far easier said than done. Because I don't really want to go around a lot of people right now. And um, I know what I have to do. I know that I, I at least have to put intentional effort in to being good to the people I am around. And that that's going to, kind of like to get out of a rut. To get out of a rut is to just do. The motivation cycle, I said this in a recent video and I got reminded of it by a comment. It's um, motivation, action, result. I, I don't remember, but basically there's like a cycle of, of your life and of ambition, I guess. And you can start anywhere in the cycle. Everyone thinks they have to start at motivation, but you can start at action and it will give you, oh, maybe it's motivation, inspiration, action. And you can start at motivation. You can start at inspiration. You can start at action. Taking action is the quickest way to get out of a rut, whether you like to admit it or not, easier said than done. Forcing yourself to be around people and to provide value for other people and to be that helpful person and fulfill the needs of others and be there for other people is the quickest way out of loneliness. And that's something I had to adopt because up until these past, these last past couple, these last couple years, I, I was a pretty lonely kid. Um, it was very lonely. And like, I don't know, I struggled with porn addiction. I was not confident at all. Didn't know how to talk to a girl if you put a gun to my head. And all that's changed now, which helps a lot, but I, I still feel like I have these 
habitual instincts to like when I get fed up with people to isolate. I don't know if that's relatable to any of you. Yeah, nothing quick for today. I kinda, I was gonna talk about like I deep cleaned my closet in my room, and I was gonna talk about how like cleaning your environment gives you mental clarity. But then I was like, just sat down and I'm like, that's just not what I'm feeling. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed nonetheless. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you all have the bestest of days and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.